what's going on it's your boy Fulman plays back with another video and today I'm going to be showing you how to use OBS cuz a lot of people are wondering and a lot of videos on YouTube don't really show you how so that's why I was gonna show you so let's just get started yeah so obviously OBS is a recording software and it records your computer screen and everything but a lot of people don't know how to use it and a lot of people try to figure it out on by themselves but it doesn't really work like like me so first you want to go to your settings when you um, download it which if you download it just go to OBS and download it I mean it's not that hard if you if you never download it and you want to know how to download it go find another video cuz yeah so when you hit settings you're gonna be on general so here you are general doesn't matter you don't need any of the general just just make sure your language is set to English or whatever language you have so no then you want to go to encoding and it'll say video encoding and most likely it'll be on encoder um, this one right here which says 264 after it you want to put it on quick sync I don't know why it just worked if I did so that's what I did so put it on quick sync not on this or this unless you want to put it on that because I mean it's a tutorial so you're supposed to listen to me um, just leave that blank right there because you don't need that um, and then your max bitrate I don't care what you put that as I just keep mine as a thousand because it works you know channel you want to keep a stereo because mono sucks like actually sucks so and then this one you can change up depending on your computer I just have mine at 112 because it's dope so you want to go to broadcast settings now so I'm gonna hit no because I don't need to so broadcast settings you want to put your mode it'll be on live stream most likely and if it is put it on file output only otherwise you won't be recording you'll be live streaming and you'll be live streaming to nothing so just don't be that dumb so you want to go to mode put this on file output only that's like the main thing if you don't have that you're not going to be recording so don't do anything nice big and blah 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 so you want to have your file path as a file in your computer such as mine is user um, and it goes to my name and then it goes to videos because I just put mine on videos because I'm not going to make a certain amount of files for it and then once you have it um, it will say videos dot flv you want to put an s or a money sign and a t in between that so it'll look like that and you're gonna want to put a money sign and a T and the reasoning is is because it like um crap you want a capital T just because it looks cooler so if you don't have the money sign and stuff uh, it won't actually record that and the money sign sign plus T equals full time so it'll record to that file the entire time instead of like if you set it to money sign Y, it'll only record to that file for a year or like down the list. So just set it to ST, like best thing to do. So on this one, you can just both browse for these ones. Like obviously, they're like the exact same thing except for this one's replay. So let's go to video. And no, I don't want to change. No, no, no. Okay, so video, you have your video adapter, you like your graphics card and everything so that's just fine leave it unless you have like a special one or whatever cuz if you do that's cool like I don't care um, also you want to change your um, resolution um, to whatever you want it to I just kept my normal cuz it works and it's good also you can change your um, frames per second I just keep mine at 30 cuz I don't have like a super freaking dope computer that runs 60 FPS without a problem so yeah for your audio um, you're going to want to I have just my desktop audio for this one or you can go and if you have like a special headset you can just choose that headset and it'll go through that your microphone same thing um, you can just go to default and it'll use your microphone in your computer or you can go with like a special one whatever you want um, Push to talk delays, I just don't mess with that because that's like the confusing stuff. Hotkeys, I don't have any hotkeys set. 
because I'm not that cool. So you can either have hotkeys like push to talk, push to talk to, mute, unmute mic, like whatever you want to do, start stream, stop stream, start recording, like whatever. But I think it's just easier um, doing the normal just start stuff, like whatever, it doesn't matter. Um, so you have all this stuff, you don't really need this. Microphone, note gate, I don't care. Like that's like all the scary stuff. So let's just go cancel. So you got all your settings mixed up, blah blah blah. You have it. So to record your screen, like I am right now, like you can see, like my mouse is moving, moving. Like you can see my computer, blah blah blah. You're going to want to go to sources or scenes first. Click on your scene. Um, you're gonna want to, uh, like click like to add like if you're gonna like copy or something. Like just double click like both sides of your mouse whatever so you're gonna wanna do that you're gonna wanna hit add and you're gonna wanna go hit monitor capture that like captures your screen monitor and then game capture if you want to capture like your gameplay like xbox or whatever like kinda gameplay you do so once you have these two on it like that you want to customize like your volume for this and your volume for your mic I just have this right now because I'm not actually playing a game and so it doesn't really matter about my um, game volume so I just have my mic like halfway because it's pretty good it it works fine so also if you um crap what was I gonna say if you want to record your gameplay you're gonna want to open your app such as Xbox app you're gonna want to. Crap. Would you would you load? No. Okay. So you're gonna want to open your Xbox app before you start recording. I don't know why. I just felt like it works way better. So you're just gonna want to like up like get your Xbox app first, and then go to your OBS and open that up. And if you do it right, your Xbox app will be like on the screen, and then your OBS will be in like on the screen but it'll be smaller and then you can just hit start recording and it'll start recording whatever you have on there and so that's basically how you use OBS I mean it's not much more difficult um, if you have any more questions leave the leave your question in the comments and I'll get back to you as soon as I can but like I pretty much showed you exactly how to use it you just want game capture monitor capture I don't I don't really use window capture like I don't know what the rest are for like I don't really need video Capture device is to capture like your screen for like a face cam, but it doesn't really work. I, I tried it. So you can capture text, like whatever. I just, the main thing is monitor capture and game capture. You put that on and it works like just fine. Like you don't need anything else. So, um, like I said, if you want to um, record a gameplay, you can just open your Xbox app or your Steam app, open your OBS, and then hit start recording, which is right here. Or you can hit preview stream and um, you'll see like what the recorder will actually see and then you can hit stop stream and then hit start recording and it'll actually record your gameplay so make sure you hit start recording instead of start streaming or preview stream so yeah um, if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like subscribe and if you have any trouble comment it down below and I'll get back to you like as soon as I can um, but you hopefully enjoyed this tutorial if you if it helped you make sure to leave a like like obviously like I mean, don't like don't be like that but yeah make make sure to leave a like, like totally but yeah get OBS pretty good yep mm -hmm. let's go